Thank you. All right, well now we're, um, as Secretary Beatty said, we're going to be honoring the students that, whose um, artwork we chose to uh, receive first, second, third places. Um, their schools get a check, so cash. Um, the students get gift cards who are being honored, and their artwork goes all over the state of Maryland. Uh, so the artwork for our art contest is a coloring book contest where students in high school can make drawings uh, depicting inclusion in their community. And then we uh, publish the coloring book and make it available at, at um, libraries around the state. So congratulations to our high school honorees for the 2022-2023 school year. First honorable mention, Elsa Lavoy from Kent Island High School in Queen Anne's County. And then our third place honoree is Erin Bowen from Kent Island High School in Queen Anne's County. Thank you for making such a long trip here this morning. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> In second place, we have Chelsea Beatty, no relation to Secretary Beatty. Um, from, also from Kent Island High School in Kenan's County, in case you're not noticing a, a trend, there's a lot of submissions from um, this high school and they were absolutely amazing. So, congratulations, Chelsea. And in first place, Zachary Gagliano from Kent Island High in Phoenix County. We're all heroes. There are about 600 of you here today, and hopefully even more watching us on Facebook Live. Thank you for your energy. Thank you for, with every day, making us better. And I can tell you, uh, Matt is someone who I now have, uh, have known for a while. And I consider Matt not only a leader, but a friend. Because Matt, Matt was willing to give a campaign and give a couple candidates the platform and the opportunity to listen and to learn and to share. When Matt decided to do that, we weren't doing too well in the polls. When Matt decided to do that, I think we were polling at around 1%. <laughs> Nobody could have said that where we are now was where we were headed back then. And Matt, you saw us. You believed. You thought that we deserved a place in the conversation. And I'm never gonna forget that. Because I wanna tell you right now for both myself and our remarkable Lieutenant Governor Ruin Miller, you saw us, but we wanna be very clear. We see you, and we are so excited to be your brother. And so great. for the last 20 years, and as part of that, her, her role in the work that she does as a mom and as a caregiver, also served on the board for Pathfinders for Autism. So I knew when I took this job, it was a priority, and I could tell Thank you, Sharon. It'll be on display, too. Um, I see the mission. I'm going to 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 see the